हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू टेक्नो थिंग इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी विल डिस्कस ऑन कंपायर कंस्ट्रक्शन एम सी क्यूज फॉर यूनिवर्सिटी एग्जाम सो वी विल स्टार्ट विद द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन कंपायलर ट्रांसलेट द सोर्स कोड टू ए एक्जीक्यूटेबल कोड बी मशीन कोड सी बाइनरी कोड डी बोथ बी एंड सी सो इफ यू डिस्कस अबाउट द एक्जीक्यूटेबल कोड दैट इज रनेबल एज अ प्रोग्राम और एक्जीक्यूट द कोड और प्रोग्राम बट इफ यू डिस्कस अबाउट द बाइनरी कोड और मशीन कोड सो मशीन कोड इज अ बाइनरी कोड दैट इज वंस एंड जीरोज कोड डायरेक्टली एक्जीक्यूटेबल बाय द कंप्यूटर्स सो आंसर फॉर दिस क्वेश्चन इज ओनली डी दैट इज मशीन कोड एंड बाइनरी कोड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन कंपाइलर इज प्रेफरेबल टू एन इंटरप्रिटर बिकॉज A. Debugging can be faster and easier. B. If one changes the statement, only that statement needs the recompilation. C. It is much helpful in the initial stage of program development. It can generate standalone programs that often take less time for the execution. So we know that the compiler that will generate the programs and code and that carry the exact meaning of the particular source code. So it will generate only the स्टैंड अलोन प्रोग्राम्स दैट ऑफन टेक द लेस्ट टाइम फॉर द एग्जुकेशन सो आंसर फॉर दिस क्वेश्चन इज ओनली डी नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन लिनियर एनालिसिस इज कॉल्ड डैश इन द कंपायलर फर्स्ट ए लेक्जिकल एनालिसिस बी स्कैनिंग सी टेस्टिंग डी बोथ ए एंड बी सो वॉट इज अ लेक्जिकल एनालिसिस सो लेक्जिकल एनालिसिस इज कॉल्ड एज अ लेक्जिकल analysis and scanning in the particular compiler so that will stream of the characters that read read from the left to right that will be happen in the particular lexical analyzer phase so only the lexical analysis that is a linear analysis that is only scanning and the lexical analysis so answer for this question is only d both a and b options question 4 compiler is a program that a accept the program written in the high level language and produce an object program b appears to execute the source program as if it were the machine language then c automate the translation of assembly language into the machine language then d places the program into the memory and prepare them for the execution so we know that the high level language are the java c++ c sharp python that will only produce the object program so this program that will accept this particular compiler that will accept the program that will only written in the this particular languages that is a high languages and that will produce the object program so answer for this question is only option a next question in compiler keywords of a language are recognized during a the code generation b parsing of the program c the lexical analysis of the program and d data flow analysis so we know that in the compiler keywords of the language that will be recognized during the lexical analysis so answer for this question is only the lexical analysis of the program because the keywords that will be only used in this particular phase so that is a lexical analysis phase so answer for this question is only c next question which of the following is used for grouping of characters into the tokens a parser b code generator c lexical analyzer and d code optimizer so lexical analysis means what that is a group of tokens in the program language then c Co keywords, then constants, then different types of the identifiers, strings, operators. That is nothing but your tokens. So we know that this particular group of tokens that is called as only the this the option is that is a lexical analyzer phase. So option so answer for this question is only C. That is a lexical analyzer. Next seventh, what is the output of the lexical analyzer? A list of tokens. B intermediate code. c pass tree and d machine code so we know that the output of the lexical analyzer program 
that perform only the lexical analyzer that is called as a lexical analyzer so that contain the tokens and scanners so we know that the lexical analyzer it will only contain the list of tokens so answer for this question is only a that is a list of tokens next question it that is is a process of finding the pass tree for the string of the tokens a analyzing b recognizing c tokenizing and d parsing so pass tree that is a parsing that is a graphical representation of the particular symbols that is in the particular tree structure so any pass tree that is only the that is nothing but the parsing so answer for this question is only that is a d parsing next ninth the output of the compiler is called a program b source code c object code and d link code so we know that the output of the compiler is called as a program because that is a special program that is written in the particular program so only the compiler that is called as only program so answer for this question is only program next question the process by which program code is converted into the machine language is called a execution b compilation c execution d variable declaration so we know that the compilation in the compilation or the compiler the whatever program code is that will be converted into the machine language that is only called as a compilation process that is done by the compiler so answer for this question is only compilation next the lexical analysis for the modern computer languages such as the java needs the power of which one of the following machine models is necessary and sufficient sense a finite state automata b deterministic put push down automata the next c non deterministic push down automata and d turing machine so we know that finite state automata that only contain the input output <laughs> then the different states then the relations then the output of the particular relation so answer for this question is only the finite state automata next 11th question match all the atoms that group 1 with the correct option from those given in the group 2 group 1 is the first one that is a regular expression group 2 that is the syntax analysis then next push down automata then code generation then data flow analysis lexical analysis register allocation and code optimization if you see the different options that is given in this particular a b c d so answer for this question is only b because we know that if you see the regular expression that is a notation that will be represent only the lexem patterns for the token and if you see the push down automata that is only the part of the syntax analysis and that will be design the particular parser and data flow analysis means what that is a code optimization that is a part of code optimization so that is the answer for this question is data flow analysis that is a code optimization and if we discuss about the register allocation so that is a code generation and that will contain only the input program and the output program so if you see the option that is a b means regular expression that is a lexical analysis then push down automata that is only syntax analysis then d then data flow analysis that is a code optimization and yes that is a regular allocation means what that is a code generation next the type checking is normally done during the a lexical analysis then b syntax analysis c syntax direct translation d code optimization so syntax directed translation means that translating from sequence of tokens to some other form so whatever type checking that will be done only during the syntax directed translation so answer for this question is only syntax directed translation next the one of the purpose of using intermediate code in compiler is to a making parsing and semantic analysis simpler b improve error recovery and error reporting c increase the chances of reusing the machine independent code optimizer in other compilers and d improve the register allocation so we know that the compiler basically increase the chances of reusing the different machine independent code 
so this intermediate code that will be is in the part of the compiler that is used to reusing the particular code by using the code optimizer so answer for this question is only c next in a two pass assembler symbol table is a generated in the first pass b generated in the second pass c not generated at all and d generated and use only the second pass if you know about the symbol table that, that is generated in the first pass only because that is a part and that contain the different data structure that is created by the compiler and that store the names variables classes that will be useful by the different compilers okay so this this will be generated in the first pass the answer for this question is only generated in the first pass so last question how many tokens will be generated by the scanner for the following statements the statement is given that is x is equal to x into in bracket a plus b minus 5 semicolon so answer a is 12 b 11 c 10 d 07 so answer for this question is only 12 why because the given expression is x is equal to x into a plus b minus 5 if we discuss about this particular expression then if we count the one by one symbol like x is a one then is equal to then x then into then open brace then a then plus then b then close brace then minus then 5 and then semicolon if we count this particular symbols that total symbols are 12 okay so answer for this question is only 12 thank you